Um, number 17, not knowing your audience. So you should be really clear, like you can't market to the whole world. The whole world is not your market. If you're trying to market to everybody, you're marketing to nobody. Okay, you need to be really clear on who your audience is. And there's a, a sort of a, a concept in, in uh, marketing where you have an avatar. An avatar is the person that you have in your mind when you're doing your marketing. Okay, and if you're going to get really serious about this business, your avatar is going to be super, super, super detailed. You're going to know, you're going to, when you create your avatar, you go, okay, the avatar has a name. Her name is, is Karen and she's 32 years old. She has blonde hair. She has blue eyes. She is, um, um, a guitarist. She listens to, she meditates in the morning. Um, she goes to dance events. You have to have the clarity of that avatar in your mind so when you're promoting and you're putting stuff on social media that is the person that you're communicating to okay and if you communicate you're communicating in a specific energy and a specific way and therefore all the people that are in that type of energy that type of um, consciousness will be attracted to your message it can be men can be anybody but you're laser focused on this person who you're advertising to and that makes it really much easier instead of you trying to communicate to bob and tom and sarah and jane and all these different people thousand million people you're just focusing on communicating to that one person and then everybody will come to and gravitate to that one person or that one your message because your message is really clear and it's really succinct okay 